Turn and right at Hearsons Hill roundabout from the left lane. Mr. Driving Examiner will ask you to turn right, third exit for the Tyne Tunnel. The Tyne Tunnel is the same road as the A19 North. We are going to start following road markings for A19 North. We need to start checking the middle and right door mirror and to signal to one other road users that we're turning right at the roundabout. Road markings clearly state that we need to move from the left lane to the middle lane. So you need another mirror check and if it's safe, drift into the middle lane. We've approached the roundabout in the middle lane, so we will now take up the middle lane on the roundabout. It's a good idea to count your X's as you go around the roundabout so you don't get lost. This is not an exit where the red car is emerging from, so do not count that one as the second exit. There is the second exit straight in front of you. This is where learners will now mess this up big style. What you need to do is keep the car to the left lane directly in front of you. You do not drift over to the middle lane. Train your eyes, look towards that sign, towards that curb, and follow that left curb round after the second exit. Is and signal left to leave the roundabout. Job well done. Let's try the same roundabout but this time we're going to use the right lane. Remember either lane is acceptable. Check the middle and right dormer and see if it's safe to give a signal. If you see one car overtaken, don't put the signal on, let it draw level with you, then signal to move over. If there are a lot of cars there, then do put the signal on. How do you tell when they're going to let you out? Well, it's quite simple. The car is not getting any bigger in your door mirror. Consider a sideways glance. Taking up the right lane as I go onto the roundabout and keep to the right because it doesn't spiral to the left. So I'm keeping to the right as I go around and I'm looking for number two exit. There's number two exit. Checking the left door mirror. I'm now going to take up the middle lane. Once I pass that second exit, if it's safe in that left door mirror, I'm going to signal and move back to the left lane. If it's not safe to move over to the left lane, then I'm going to come round in the middle lane and leave in the right lane and then filter back to the left lane when it's safe to do so. There is a car quite big in my left door, so I'm now going to leave in the right lane. I'm then going to keep my signal on for left and I'm going to filter back to the left as soon as it's safe to do so. Final summary, either lane is acceptable, the left lane is by far the easiest method to do this roundabout. However, if you do use the right lane, be cool, just do what I've just shown you and the exam will think you're an expert. Ha, <laughs> really? <laughs>